Hello and welcome! My name is Ahiro and this is my Let's Play series of the Open Service 4 where we are playing as Byzantium. And I was looking between episodes because I was kind of wondering where all of these people suddenly came from. It's like, I thought we were being... just helping Commonwealth kill Brandenburg and it would be a quick war, but... This is because Brittany is, al uh, is the Emperor and he called in everyone. Brittany is allied with Spain and Scotland and the Knights, Salzburg, all these kind of things, so that's why all this happened. Um, by the way, I think I'm gonna send you down here and get rid of the Knights first. So, we might as well just get going with this. Ooh, this is annoying. Um... Yeah, let's go here and then maybe go up here and then go back and kill uh let's just spare no expense. We'll just go and deal with these guys and then go and deal with the knights. That was a very quick siege. By Savoy, do we have so much Progressive expansion up there, that's crazy. Uh, we need to hire a new military guy. Let's take fort defense since we are in a war. Um, let's do war taxes. I would like to save up some money. You should probably go do stuff. You go down and deal with Messina. You do a siege split and deal with that and that. You go and deal with that. Go up there and placate that part so that it will fall next time. Then we've got to take Rome. It's probably consolidated, but I think we'll win this anyway. Gonna cost us a lot of manpower though. Go and take Salzburg. Uh, let's just do this. Then we go take Rome after. Let's just go and blockade that. Let's go down and blockade here first though. Let's get this done. Oh yeah, and we should probably send out one of our diplomats. I think I'm probably going to be focusing a little bit on some Muslim countries uh, while this coalition goes away. Um, in this area. So let's, uh, let's, let's claim on you as well. Not that you have that many provinces that we can claim on, but might as well use it. And then let's just like, improve with... Oh, why are we having so low Cossack raids, aggressive expansion? Let's just improve with you guys. That's very low. That's enough to maybe make him want to get rid of the alliance. And that's not nice. Mamluks. Everything is going great, isn't it? Let's go down here. I think I'm just gonna go and stand in Rome. See what he does. Let's 
can go crush him with this one if he stays. You're doing that. This is annoying because it's gonna cost me a bunch of war exhaustion. But I just wanna get get this this part done. Kinda don't wanna do fighting on all fronts at the same time. If you can make Fable State and Salzburg and people like this just leave the war, that's gonna be really helpful. Come on, just fall already. Yeah, you should go and kill those. Don't let them come down here and attack me. Okay, so you need to get up here now. Should we just kill these first? Let's just take a chance. And a major revolt up there, because why not? And yeah, you go there. You go there. And you go there. Yeah, because this is hills and I won't get a defensive bonus there. But if I attack them here, I will... It, it won't be any defensive bonus, but at least I'll be... Um, I'll not have anything against me. And you leave one guy... Actually, let us do this. Leave these and then go there. Let's hope we can win this. Uh, let's just do this. I think... Oh, it's annoying that you can't easily see... So the 14 are the ones going to Roma, yeah. And you go there. And blockade. And Salzburg is done. Let's go deal with these troops. Aust Ooh. So question now is, do we want to get rid of the alliance with Austria? Let's just decline for now. It's not like that they're not going to be mad that we didn't marry them. We can always marry them later. Um, I might might want to send a guy to improve relationships, though, just in case I want to keep the alliance for now. I, I do want to keep them at least until we have attacked France, but if we can do that without being royally married to them, so we can drop the alliance right after, that would be the perfect situation. That may way we might actually be able to save this mess. Let's just attack here. Wasting a lot of manpower on this war, but we should really be winning this. Uh, that's way too much manpower. <sighs> and we're not even gaining anything from this. This is just like, ah. Uh... That's almost all of our manpower just gone. Just bye bye. Commonwealth, you you have to pay for this. You'll have to fight some war for us. Rome fell. That's something at least. Uh, let's go. And 
take care of some more room or some more um, papal state maybe he'll give up then we take those two he is out um, you go down there then So one of you will go here and one of you will go there. And then we'll transport all of our guys to to Spain and start attacking him. So we're down to a few probably better numbers now. Yeah. And we can do our last province here so what can we get we can get oh let's just get authority Combine. Okay, you go and get him. At least we get, hopefully, get some pints out of this. We don't even get to decide ourselves what we if we take anything from Spain, which is annoying. Um, let's go pick them up. this uh, yeah there's not really that much fleet to oppose us anymore Question if if you can do a seed split up here. No, you'll have to do it back on the ship. Uh, let's just stay there then. Smooth the ships. And then you go and pick those guys up. And you go here. I'm not gonna put them in in here yet. Spain, are you also in war with Mali and Sus? Okay. Um. in there and then we're gonna get go get this guy and then we're gonna start to take our stuff back in Spain and then so you both go there instead um 
Institute's prestige. So you go here. Yeah, let's just renew it. Oh, we have so much admin point. I would really, really like to take some land and core it, I think. I think we just take a war against Persia after this. Or we just take some land and just like core it ourselves. So the knights are out. And nothing, just money. Stupid Brandenburg. And go get that. Yeah, force those out so I can kill them. Just send a thousand there. No reason to take attrition for all of those. And all of our conversions are done. So we are so primed for taking more land now, but we just have to get this wall over with. So, 27 heavies against this. This should be a, a, a quick... And yet, we are the ones losing, as far as I can see. I don't... I really, really don't understand how this works. Oh, okay, they're sinking now, it seems. No, we are losing... we are actually losing ships. What in the... Name of all that is holy is happening. So we lost nine heavies. That's insane. Okay, you go here. I don't want to get rid of some of those transfers because that's just way too many. Uh, So what is the newest one called? I think... Yeah, Merchant Man is the newest one, so let's get rid of some of those bricks. Go protect in Alexandria. I would just like wait and then we'll sail over here once we have a coastal province to put them in. Oh well, we basically have. Um, you go there then. Oh, and you put up an army well. Then you go there instead.
take that first. Bang and bang. So you go there. <sighs> yeah, let's just take care of those. Just wait a month for reinforcements. And do that. Yeah, and we're crushing. And... I should be deleting this. That was quick. There you go, take Toledo. And then delete it. That was nice. So now the numbers are really in our favor. And the worst of the manpower loss should be over. You just get on board and we go over here. And with that in mind, I think I'm going to end this episode here. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, consider the like button, subscribing. Hope to see you next time. Until then, have a good day.